In this video, we want to find the limit as x and y approach 0 of sine of xy squared over 3 minus the square root of xy squared plus 9. The best way to, to do this problem is to make a substitution. So why don't we let z equal xy squared. So as x and y approach 0, 0, then z will also approach 0 since 0 times 0 squared is 0. So now we say limit as z approaches 0, sine of z over 3 minus the square root of z plus 9. We're going to solve this by multiplying the top and the bottom by the conjugate of the denominator. And I'm going to leave the numerator factored. In the denominator, it's a difference of two squares, which is 9 minus the quantity z plus 9. The 9's cancel, we're left with negative z in the denominator. Now I can use a product rule for limits and break this up. I factor out the negative outside. I have sine of z over z. And then the second limit is 3 plus the square root of z plus 9. The limit as z approaches 0 of sine of z over z is 1. And then the limit of 3 plus square root of z plus 9 is 6. Multiplying those two, we get our final answer as negative 6.